Well, when you got shot in 97, they gave you Percocets. Mind you, I never heard of them before. I never knew nothing about them. Because they, they, I think Percocets came out in 95. I think they got invented like 90. So I got them as soon as they got invented. Like they gave them to me. And I got, I didn't even know they was a drug until like somebody told me one day I was in jail. I'm like, yo, I feel crazy. Boy, like, you take Percocets? You going through withdrawal. I said, what? And so I never, I mean, so like the doctor's giving us well, 18 year old kid Percocets. I mean, not telling them, not giving them. But, I, but one thing about me, I was going to jail so much, I never got a chance to really be all the way addicted to them. Yeah, I get locked up. I mean, I got, you know, locked up, they don't give you Percocets. So, I mean, so, I mean, that's, that's like, it. but once I found out I was going to withdraw, and I like, I, I got, I left him alone, cold turkey. I mean, yeah. I mean, Beanie had his struggles with drugs over the years, you know, between lean and, and pills and so forth. Um, you know, I remember at one point, the first time I interviewed him, he was like really, really heavy. This yeah. was like right before he went to jail. And then I think he got caught with drugs. Yeah right before he was supposed to get locked up and they, they locked him up early. Um, yeah, man. I mean, pills, it, it seems like pills have taken over everything. You know, people don't understand though, sometimes like when you, in, in the ghetto, right, you go through all these different things that we, we act like it's normal. Like seeing your friends die, getting shot, going to prison, right? But it's not normal. So sometimes when you do drugs, people be just really coping. I mean, they really be coping and without that drug, they probably won't, they won't, they probably won't make it. You mean, because I mean, talking about like, and then you can't even complain about it. Like, like you can't be like, well, I'm, I'm stressed out because I, cause everybody look at you weird. Like, you stressed out because you got shot. When you, when you should be stressed out. Like, I mean, but like you, in the hood, you, got, you can't show no weaknesses. You can't, I mean, so like the whole culture of it is like, you got to try to just deal with it on your own. You know I mean, even as a young kid, you got to deal with it on your own. And sometimes everybody can't handle it sober. You know what I'm saying? So you just be escaping. I mean, but see, I'm not, I mean, I never did like smoke weed or smoke or nothing like that. I used to drink a lot, but then I stopped really doing that. You know what I mean? Like, I mean, because one thing about prison, they keep, they keep, they keep prison going to keep you sober. <laughs> I mean, being that you're living your best life. <laughs> you know what I mean? But, you know what I mean? 